Hi there, I'm Mark Sebastian, founder of OptionPit.com with your trader tip of the day. Today, I'm gonna to talk to you about big money flow. Sometimes you'll read headlines about traders buying 100,000 calls or 10,000 calls in this stock or 25,000 calls in this stock or buying puts in a stock, 50,000 in this stock, 30,000 in that stock. Now, when, I, when someone buys calls, they generally think a stock is going up. When they buy puts, they generally think a stock is going down, unless they don't. Sometimes there is more to a story than simply an option trade. A lot of trades that go up on the SIBO, the American Stock Exchange, on the New York Stock Exchange or the International Stock Exchange, they can actually be done tied to stock. That means I am simultaneously trading an option and a stock at the same time. So if I buy a call and then sell stock at the same time, am I still bullish? Maybe not. If I buy a put and then I buy stock at the same time, am I still bearish? Maybe not. So folks, the key to big money flow is that you have to understand that there's usually a much bigger story to just that trade. Sometimes a trade is done as a hedge against bonds. Sometimes a trade is done as a hedge against a big, huge, long stock position. But sometimes a trade is done as an actual speculative play on a stock moving up or down. The key is you need to know the full story. If you don't know the full story and you don't know how to get it, then big money flow really doesn't help you very much when it comes to options. And you should stick to your guns of just using your own research, using your own analysis, using your own due diligence to create stock trades and option trades. So there you have it, folks. Just be aware there's often more to the story than just a single trade. I'm Mark Sebastian from OptionPit.com with your trader tip of the day. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.